the best, creamiest mac and cheese you've ever had. And it only has four ingredients. Here we go. Macaroni, cavatappi here, unsalted butter, three kinds of cheese, so I lied, I counted cheese as one ingredient, and cream, and a couple of garnishes. We're going to start with three tablespoons of unsalted butter in a nonstick medium skillet over medium heat. Let the butter start to melt, and then we're going to add one and three quarter cups of cream. What you'll notice is the one element you find in 95% of uh, mac and cheese recipes is gone, and that's flour. And we're going to uh, make the sauce thicker by reducing the cream. I'm not using flour, not making a roux, nothing, but you got to have cream and butter. Make sure you stir the simmering cream once in a while because it will boil over. After about seven to eight minutes of simmering, check the consistency, see how it runs off the spatula. Now we're gonna add one cup of sharp white cheddar, quarter cup of Gruyere, and a quarter cup of grated Parmesan cheese. Stir it in real well and let the cheeses melt. After a couple minutes, see how it coats the back of the spoon. Should be a sauce consistency and not real thick. If it is real thick, thin it out with a little pasta water. Turn off the heat and get ready to put it together. Put your cooked pasta in a large bowl. Uh, in this case, I used cavatappi. Now your incredibly beautiful and smooth, creamy cheese sauce. Now fold it all together with a wooden spoon or a rubber spatula and get it mixed together really well. Get yourself a small baking dish and spray it with pan spray. Uh, in this case, I used uh, two small gratin dishes. Load them both up with the mac and cheese. Now I topped one with panko crumbs uh, mixed with uh, some butter. I topped the other one with grated Parmesan cheese. That's the way Loretta likes it. I like it with the panko crumbs. Stick them under the broiler for maybe a minute or so just to get them kind of browned on top. The one with the grated Parmesan cheese gets chopped chives. Which one do you prefer? Chopped chives? Panko crumbs? Chopped chives? They're both good. <laughs>